Oh wow, I look so crazy. Hello you guys, happy freaking weekend, yeah. It is a Friday. Hello you guys, hey, hey girl, what's going on? It is currently 11.07 p.m. on a Friday. One of my favorite things to do, honestly, on a Friday is order in, but I've decided to make some delicious little quesadillas. We're about to pop a poppy, mm. This flavor, obsessed. Usually on Fridays, Des and I stay up till very late. I have no new shows to watch, like, I already caught up on all the season of Love is Blind, you guys. Tell me what you feel. How are you feeling about all of this? Nothing to watch today. But I was like, I'm just in the mood to talk to you guys. You want more food, Woody? I feel like he's hungry. I made him this turkey. The same taste. I usually like to batch Jupiter's food. I didn't have any carrots or anything like that. Actually, I did have carrots, I lied, but I didn't want to give it to him. Jupiter, come. Ta-da! Go booty. PJs from Target, this cozy thing. I have my fresh flowers, a clean kitchen. Oh, life is good. Life is real good. This weekend, we don't really have like a lot planned, but I like it that way. One of my friends invited me this weekend to yoga and I turned her down and I was like, oh my God, girl, I just feel like I need a day at home. Honestly, I've been going out so much. For me, one social event a week is more than enough. Like I can't do more than that. And this week I already had it. So, okay, I don't know how I'm gonna take all of this. Let's do our best. Yeah, no, I need, okay, hold on, I'll be back. Let's surprise Dennis. <laughs> I'm an amazing wife. Mm, mm -mm. See, this is all I wanna be doing on a Friday night. Eating my little quesadilla, maybe watching some YouTube. Just chilling, girl. How cozy this is. There's nothing cozier. Droopy, I'm not giving you any. Mm. Okay, so this weekend, I already planned my day tomorrow in my best me journal. And this weekend, honestly, doing myself grace over the gym. I love Saturday workouts. And I've been recently doing Pilates. I've been obsessed. But I feel like I need to sleep in a little bit tomorrow. So I'm going to do that. <gasps> oh my God, I totally forgot to tell you guys that my makeup vanity arrived. I'm so freaking excited to put it all together. I think I've told you guys in the past few vlogs, the bathroom situation is not working. Like I keep clashing and I feel like I need my own space. We have a spare room downstairs. So I'm gonna use that as like my little makeup room. I'm excited. Oh my God, there's gonna be a lot of like redecorating home decor stuff happening in the next few vlogs. Mm -hmm. I just wanna say hi, cause it is Friday and that's what we're gonna do. So good, wow. Also, these are zero carb tortillas, so good. I'm not gonna give you any booty. No. Mm -mm. No. Good morning. Happy Saturday. Putting on a nail, of course. Nails are falling off recently. Day on the agenda, we're gonna go get my bush burned. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing laser in my bikini area. It is one of the most painful things I have done. I finished eight laser sessions for my legs and it is one of the most life-changing things. There's so much truth in becoming like a high maintenance, low maintenance girly. And I just feel like that has really changed my life. So I'm not doing my armpits, but I'm thinking about it. I don't know if any of you have done your armpits. Let me know how it was. I'm just a little bit scared because I feel like that's around like the breast area, but I need to be going now. I didn't even have time to do my makeup this morning. I did the overnight blowout. So I think the hair should look kind of good. We'll find out. Dennis is nice enough to make me breakfast this morning and we're actually gonna be building my vanity later. No, not this spilling everywhere. See, this is why I like waking up early. I completely slept in today. I don't like feeling rushed like this. I don't like this at all. It is what it is. I need to sleep in this morning. Let's go. I think the nail might fall off, honestly. Hey, Jupy. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm gonna get it out there. All right, bye everybody. Bye. A little vlog. <laughs> Ay, muy bien, esta no va a ser linda. Este día. 24, ¿no? Ay, sí. Ay, guau. Ay, guau. Ay, guau. Ay, guau. Y mire, 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 está cortito. Ay, no, qué belleza. Yo no estoy con mi estado. ¿Cómo? Yo siento que a mí se me esperan. Muy bien. Ay, Dios. Yo colocar este por ahí. A ponerla. Ay, ay, ay. Did you guys see how much I was suffering? I'm a baby for this. Literally, one of the most painful things I've done here. Oh, it's so bad. And I forgot to bring my little squishy, so. The hair turned out cute. 
We made it to Ulta. I decided to do a little detour and come on over. Sometimes I just feel like you need retail therapy and I just feel like I need to look at girly things. I'm always home, so I feel like the little moments that I get to just go out for a little bit and look at girly things, it really just like lifts my spirit. I'm gonna put footage from TikTok because it's still uncomfortable even after 10 years to bring in a vlog camera. Like I just can't do it. I literally can't. Have you tried this before? Like have you tried going out in public and recording yourself? It's very awkward. Happy Saturday. Come with me to go shop at Ulta. We're gonna have some retail therapy today. Here's today's little oat. We have some pop flex and some nice little like loungy wear. I was looking for Summer Fridays, but that is a Sephora brand. Oh my god, I used to love this. How cute these are. Oh my goodness. I feel like I'll go through this in like two days. I feel like I need this because I'm balding. It looks kind of promising. It's $34. Still too cheap for this. I can't. These are my favorite. Such a fan of this. Love it. I don't want to take this. I've heard some great things. Okay, I ended up getting way more than what I needed. That was bound to happen. I'm actually about to go and put all this into my new vanity. I'm so excited. My husband promised me he's going to help me build it. So I'm going to put all this fresh stuff in there. And we're getting Taco Bell tonight. So it's going to be a good night. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. I'll see you in the next one where I'm organizing all of my makeup. Bye. All right, you guys, let's do a little Ulta haul. Okay, so I purchased makeup wipes. I know these are terrible for my face, but every once in a while when I'm traveling, I need them. I have been seeing these everywhere. Let me focus. I hear that it works really well with people with ADHD, so I don't know. I've been kind of curious. It has Lion's Mane. Okay. Mm. Next thing I purchased is a Tangler teaser. This is one of the best hairbrushes. I love it. I am obsessed with Osea. I love their skincare. Fully Rock Christina was the one that first got me onto this in Bali. She literally gifted us so much Osea, and it's one of my favorites. This was 54 butter. 54 butter. Why do I keep saying that? This was $54, but I will spend so much money on body butter. I love it. And finally, Dr. Teals. Ooh, I love taking my little baths with this. I'm going to see if Dennis wants to head out to Taco Bell now because I am hungry. Oh, look who's paying today. It's a forty-one dollar date. We didn't do our date night this Damn, week. Damn, we're going real well. Yeah, this is the best way for us to spend the week. I gotta build later. But you were the one that said you wanted to help <laughs> for me. For you, because I'm gonna do Thanks, Tony. You guys know those TikToks where they're like, when you're a passenger princess and you can turn off your brain. <laughs> I do feel that way every time Dennis is here, which is why it's so stressful for me to drive. How do you say malacostumbrar? Spoiled. Spoiled me, for sure. How do you say malacostumbrar? How do you say? Yeah. It went dong. Like <gasps> we're about to try Taco Bell's new menu. We're so excited. What did you order? A bunch of shit. No worry about it. Nice. So Dennis and I have made it a point to use Uber less because we realized how much money we were spending. Sometimes it is just nice to get out of the house and see the real world a little bit, especially us because we work from home. Oh my god. Sorry, I'm, I'm embarrassed now. Hey. <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna wait until he gets into the car. It's a little bit awkward. Why is this? This is always. This is always a, a thing. Is one thing I've been noticing as I have been editing these videos is just like how much chin fat I have. I know really not that important, but I've just been wondering. I've been seeing that like new face thing and wondering if I should get it because I have also noticed my face is falling. Like obviously I'm about to be 30, but you know what I mean? It's so crazy how you, you just start to change. I feel like this, this much has fallen. That, wow, that's so crazy. It's cute though. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, is this? Zero. Oh, my favorite. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the best day ever. <laughs> and he says we're not gonna eat in the car. Mm, okay, he's like, we're gonna take this home. Oh my God. Oh my God. So now we go home, right? Uh, if you want to, where the hell do you wanna go? I don't wanna eat. <laughs> Yeah, home. <laughs> I was gonna say that on the podcast I had mentioned how mm -hmm. for you, your your love language is for me to do stuff for you. Acts of service. Acts of service, right? Mm -hmm. So like how today I'm gonna build that table for you. Yes, I feel very loved. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> it is a very weird love Would language. I get it. But yours is also gift, so I think that's kind of odd too. Yeah, my my gift to you is the table, mm -hmm. not the building of it. But like whatever then. Yeah. Spuds, my lord. Spuds. Okay, hey, wait, wait, wait. Hold up, no, hold no, up, I hold up. That, that wasn't yours, but okay. I really did not appreciate waiting this long. I'm angry in the car. <laughs> you on the vlogs are starting to get to know the real Natalie now. <laughs>
Yeah, don't mess with my hangriness. Thanks, honey. These hard tacos are yours. I got mm. you this. What's that? Chicken and banana. This is, oh a, new, it's a, new one. It's a new from the menu. Wow. Oh my god, it's so crunchy. This is also new on the menu. Oh my god, it's Check so. It. That one doesn't look that good, to be honest. But, but whatever. Chicken and banana? Mm. <laughs> oh wow. It's so crunchy. There. This is just what I wanted, honey. There's something about eating bad that's so good. Mm -hmm. Especially uh, on a day after hard week's workout. Hard week. A hard week, period. Period. <laughs> Taco Bell don't miss. Taco Bell don't miss. Because I would put her near the front. Why? I love the Ooh, shoes. Oh, I did not. I like, I like the, the pants. Glass. I like the, the shoes. Glasses are super fun. And They're the glasses. Really I like the little outfit. I really didn't know how this was going to translate. Is that her tone of root? So I would say just for now, maybe swap right here. Just for now. I, I mean, for me, I would put her near the I know. I should grab one. Honestly, just because okay. it's like a tattoo or something. I'm here. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Bob the Builder. <laughs> what do I do without my husband or my dad? Literally, I don't. I cannot follow instructions. I don't know how to build things. No, actually, let's be positive. Let's be positive. Excited, you guys. Oh, first of all, the fact that I get to look outside my patio and it's gorgeous, and we have my little lettuce grow over there. What a dream. So I already sketched everything out. As you see, what's happening here is a lot of what was in the conference room is going to be moved here, and vice versa. Dennis doesn't know that, nor will he love that, but. That's the vision. I'm so excited. It's gonna look so cute. Hey, how full are you? So full. So full, so full. This is the plan, but don't worry about the plan. Why does it say Wayfair? <laughs> you have no idea what's happening, but I'm very happy. I feel like I just moved into like a new place. That's what this feels like. <laughs> so what, do I just sit here and look pretty? <laughs> Go get my tools, fool. I will. I'm the helper today. Let's get a lunchbox. <laughs> I guess we just wait. Let me know what else in here would be amazing to have. What do we think? Carpet? Do we like carpet? Because I have a few pieces. What would be nice to have in here? A mirror, for sure. We need a big ass mirror. Hours later, it's currently. 8.15. This has a lot of parts to it. And I'm not even gonna lie, I just showed up. <laughs> and I'm also not gonna lie, I'm already tired. <laughs> I got there. Let me just say it real quick. This is not a flattering moment for me. And thus, ignore the hair and the just waking up. This is day two of building. And it's taking a lot longer than I thought. This shit is puny. It is a small table. But I think overall for what we are gonna do here, which is just create content, this isn't gonna be like her main desk. I appreciate it for what it is. Um, it's nice that it's gonna have an extension. You can put like a hair blow dryer thing here. It's neat. The, I would say the drawers don't feel, I don't know. We'll see at the end. I'll give it a little review. Happy Sunday! Okay, I don't know where I left off. I think last time we were um, in a Taco Bell coma and we tried to continue building and girl, this took so long. You ready to see her? Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh my God. Be honest with me. Tell me what you think. She is a lot smaller than I had anticipated. Ta -da, ta -da -da, ta -ta -ta. Very sleek, right? Very like clean. However, this is so tiny. Compared to my vanity upstairs, I'm kind of nervous. Maybe it'll be a way for me to be a little bit more of a minimalist. You know, I'll still have my vanity upstairs for like filming purposes. This one is more like my everyday and like get ready with me's and stuff like that. I am a little disappointed with one thing. Let me just tell you. Lighting on here is not as bright as I thought. I'm still gonna have to bring my lights upstairs. I thought this was gonna be way brighter. So I don't know, like she's sleek, she looks cute. 
I like how she's small. And actually, Dennis has yet to build the little bench that goes in here. So I like that she doesn't take up too much room. To be honest, I'm afraid my stuff is not gonna fit. Like I'm gonna have to make it work. So welcome to the conference room. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take this, we're gonna take her downstairs, we're gonna take that one downstairs, and we're gonna take this gorgeousness downstairs. See, I'm not too worried because whenever I do get like PR and stuff, this is gonna really serve its purpose and then I can use this to put other stuff in it. We currently actually underutilize these in here. So I'm gonna make it work. I'm really excited. Hello, you guys. Not me walking around butt naked. Hold on, let's just make sure. Let's do this. Oh my god. Oh, what's with the eye bags, girl? We're gonna have a nice little intimate chat. Tell you what ended up happening today on this lovely Sunday. Basically, I ended up uploading a new YouTube video that took me a lot of my day. Dennis finished the vanity as well. That was really nice. I finished some TikToks and then we went out to eat. We're celebrating my parents because I'm so happy for them. They're gonna start building their house. <gasps> And I'm just so excited for them. They bought this beautiful land and my parents are going to be building their dream home. And I'm so excited for them. Now I'm back home. Dennis is playing with his friend, Juan, my cousin, who's about to have a baby. And who knows, anytime soon, he's about to have a baby. So Dennis is kind of sad because his little gamer friend is no longer going to be available. So weird how life just starts to change. And I woke up at 4 a.m. this morning. I woke up with just a lot on my mind, specifically just how quickly life moves. I had like anxiety over a lot of things. Started overthinking everything. I don't know. Sometimes that happens to me. But this is like a little therapy talk. Um, when I was just overthinking, I actually journaled about this. So give me just a second. Also, how weird is it that this camera's back here? We were doing thumbnail today. Oh, yeah, it's kind of sad. I was worrying about life, how short it all feels. I have a lot of family members who are sick, like, out of nowhere. And it's been, like, very serious. Uh, like, actually, four. It's pretty crazy, like, four people in my family. It's been really hard. I wrote here, will my parents be around? For me, I feel like that's a really big fear. I just fear not doing enough with them. I don't know. I fear being able to travel or fulfill all of our dreams. <laughs> this is really sad. Like, when will I have kids? Like, there's just so much unknown and I can't even believe that I'm at that baby stage. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's not like I am pregnant and in trouble for being like a teenage, a teenage pregnancy, but I'm gonna feel like I have a teenage pregnancy at 30. Like, it's just gonna be that way. And it's so weird. Like, I'll have my mother-in-law, we were at the restaurant, we were looking at pictures of my niece and she was like, oh my god, you see Natalie? Like, they grow up so fast. You don't have anything to worry about. I can't believe I'm at that stage where like my mother-in-law is so any time now it's just very weird it's just weird growing up is weird entering a new stage in my life is also it just feels it feels kind of nostalgic i don't know growing up dennis is about to come and now he's gonna see me crying like why is it uncomfortable for me to cry for my husband not really but it's just like those casuals like if he just walks in and i'm crying then it's like i'm gonna have to explain everything it's I'm not about that right now. I don't know how much I actually was able to vlog, but uh, it is the end of the weekend. Tomorrow starts Monday. I didn't get a chance to plan my week, which I always do on Sundays, but you know what? Some days, just life. You have to just be present, be with family, and relax. I'm also going to start on my vanity, which I'm really excited. So I'll start the vlog tomorrow. I don't know. Do you also fear like growing up a little bit, or is it fun and exciting? Like I feel like there was a time in my life where I was like, I'm just so ready to like grow up and move out and be married and all this stuff, and now I'm just like, can we slow down for a little bit? Like it's it's wow it's pretty wild thanks for hanging out with me it's been really fun i've really been enjoying these vlogs just like connecting with you that's what it feels like i want to send you lots of love and i hope that you're doing well i'll see you in the next one